Hello viewers, in this video, I would like to give a comparison on the two most talked about Nexus tablets, that is the new Nexus 7 that was released in July 2013 and the Nexus 10 which was released in November 2012. Both these tablets can give us pure Google experience without having any custom user interface on the top of it and can receive upgrades and updates as and when Google releases it. We will consider most of the major features while comparing these devices and at the end of the video I'll tell you my personal choice and why. We will start with the manufacturer. Nexus 7 is manufactured by Asus and the Nexus 10 is manufactured by Samsung. Nexus 7 supports a micro SIM card whereas Nexus 10 do not support a SIM. Now let's compare the dimensions and weight. The default orientation of Nexus 7 is portrait whereas Nexus 10 is landscape. And from the figures, the dimension of the Nexus 7 is smaller than Nexus 10 because Nexus 7 is a 7 inch tablet and Nexus 10 is a 10 inch tablet. And the weight of Nexus 7 is almost half of the weight of Nexus 10. When we consider the display, we can see that Nexus 7 has LED backlit IPS screen which gives brighter colors with better viewing angle. Though the Nexus 10 has more number of pixels, the pixel density is more in Nexus 7. That is 323 PPI which is the highest of PPI in any device in the market today. Now let's consider the sound. Both these devices support 3.5mm jack with stereo speakers but Nexus 7 support virtual surround sound through headphone. Memory specification of these two devices are identical. When it comes to connectivity, both these devices support Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, NFC, micro USB and GPS connectivity. But the new Nexus 7 also support GPRS, Edge, 3G and 4G connectivity. Nexus 7 also supports a Bluetooth low energy technology which enables this device to interact with Bluetooth smart devices which are used in the area of entertainment, sports and healthcare. For example, the Nexus 7 can be paired and connected with a Bluetooth heart rate monitor which will give you the complete profile of our heart rate while we do exercise. Now let's consider the Android OS. The new Nexus 7 comes with Android 4.3 Jelly Bean version which has got features such as restricted profiles, Bluetooth Smart Ready, OpenGL ES 3.0 which is used for very high quality gaming etc. But of course the Android OS of the Nexus 10 can be upgraded to Android 4.3 Jelly Bean. When we consider the chipset, CPU and GPU of these two devices we can see that the Nexus 7 has a more powerful hardware which will let us perform multitasking operations. When we analyze the camera we can see that the Nexus 10 has a slightly better specification because it is equipped with 1.9 megapixel front cam with the rear cam supported by an LED flash. Now let's compare the batteries of these devices. Though the Nexus 10 has a higher rated battery that is 9000 mAh, the backup time given by these two devices is the same. That's because Nexus 10 is a bigger tablet and more pixels are to be lighted up. Moreover, Nexus 7 also supports wireless charging. And the last but not the least is the price comparison. When you compare the corresponding models of these two tablets, you can see that Nexus 7 is a cheaper tablet than Nexus 10. Before we conclude this quick comparison video, I would like to tell you my personal choice of the device based on price, portability and performance. That is the new Nexus 7. And we have seen that it carries a lower price tag when we compare the corresponding models. When it comes to portability, the new Nexus 7 can be handled with one hand and it can give us very good performance because of its excellent hardware specifications. So that was the comparison on two awesome Nexus tablets. Hope you have enjoyed this video. 
For more videos on the new Nexus 7, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for your time.